Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Chad and Russ Play Video Games on the Internet, featuring Christine. Yeah. Uh, she's giving another go at 60 seconds. I believe in you. <laughs> Thanks. How long did you last when you played? Me? Yeah. First time? I don't. First time I played it, I don't remember. Mm. I beat it. Oh, you actually, there was you like... Have, yeah. You can make it through yeah, the you whole can, thing. The whole point of this is to try to escape the wasteland. Okay. In a, in a UFO or a blimp? The UFO, there's, they've added so much shit since I've played it. Like, it's been, I haven't played it in about my play through, two years. My playthrough uh, okay. involved a cat that oh, really? apparently wasn't in it when you were huh. when you were doing it. Yeah. There was a dog, but the cat, I think, was new. Um, there is one thing that I've never been able to do. And it's just, it's... This is really epic. Yeah. I feel like Rick we're going to be... music. This music da, da, is da, the, da. the music. Woo! I feel, like Woo! I feel like we're a great adventure going to blast off in the, yeah. the, the seat, the moving seats. So the, there's one thing that could happen to... Was it Tina? Was the daughter? Mary Jane? Mary Jane. That's it. Um, there is a way for her to get infected uh, with like radioactivity or something and she turns into a mutant. Oh my god. Jesus. The thing is she if she becomes a mutant, you fucking you send her out on expeditions. Really? She yeah. So oh, she's not she's like immune. evil. No. Just mutant. No, she's just like she looks like something from that movie uh Freaks with uh, Alex Winter oh, and no. Andy Quaid. All right. Hmm. You all remember Freaks. Freaked. Freaked. Yeah. Different movie. With Freaks. an exclamation mark. Yeah. <laughs> All right. The one that I got autographed. Yeah, by Alex Winter. By Alex Winter. Bill from Bill and Ted. I'm so excited that they're making another Bill and Ted. Uh, it better happen. They it's said so it. up and down. They Back it's, when you got that thing signed, Alex Winter was like, yeah, we're working on it right now. No, yep. but they actually, he, him and... They even had the Entertainment Weekly cover, didn't they? Yep. Or something like that, but... Who but knows? it also, it went into, like, flux. It's still in flux. Yeah. It's... I hope it gets made. Me too. I hope so, too. But as long as it's a good script. Especially it, the story that they've talked about is that Bill and Ted, based off the first two movies, they were supposed to write a song that was going to change the world, change yeah. the universe. Yeah. They're now in their 40s, 50s, and they still haven't written the song. It's and that's premise. the concept. That's good. And, yeah, I fucking... Oh. Just talk about William Sadler coming back as death. Yep. I hope oh, which is amazing. I love him. The yeah. fact that... Because they'll probably have time travel in, involved somehow. And the fact that they would mix the the first movie and the second movie with death and everything. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Christine, get out there. All right. I don't know. Maybe you'd have better luck as Ted. No. Why? It's a man. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting, Chad. I know. How could you? <sighs> God all, right. all right. Look around first. Ten seconds to look around. So all, right. all those highlighted things. Axe? You got shit all over. There's a map. A there's bottles of water. First aid kit. How much do you uh, really care about your kids? No, Christine, this is look around time. No, it's fine. It's fine. Stay right here. Grab her. Yeah. Go ahead. All right, go. Oh, wrong way. Wrong oh, way. Oh, no. You're the Oh fuck! It's in a different spot this time. Oh, oh there you go. They fucked no, me. it's all in the same. It's always in the it? same oh, spot. Okay, but I guess it's like the starting point was different. Yeah. Right. So, uh, look around for stuff. Ted, 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 get Ted. I mean, grab gun, gun, gun on the wall. Throw the accent. Throw the accent. Grab the gun. Grab everything that you can. All right. Nice. All right. Where's Ted? He's oh. in there. Jesus! Oh Jesus, Christine! Are right, you gonna have to drop that Ted's stuff in, in that, there first? In that room. Ted's in that room. I know. So okay, you're, you're good. Water first. Well, you're Where's confident this time. Is that Where? a bong? I don't know. Thought I saw. All right. I have a lot of soup again. Christine, you have 10 seconds. Oh, oh my God. Fuck. Oh my God, Christine, you can't save your husband. You can't save your husband. Oh, no. You don't have the time. Grab maybe one other thing, like that water, and then go, 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 go. You, you have two seconds. Ted? Two goddamn seconds. Sorry, Ted. She didn't have time. I knew this was going to happen. She didn't leave him herself enough time. I knew she'd eventually leave him. Yeah, well. Oh, poor Ted. Oh, well. But is he dead? Or will he come back somehow? <laughs> That's, that goes by so quick. It does. I couldn't. I wanted yeah, no, to find water. Hey, but at least he got a gun and an axe. It's true. <sighs> oh, no. They won. So here we are. The three of us are safe and sound. We we just need to make it work. <laughs> oh, man. I feel bad. We just need to make it for, uh, work from now on. We really wish it was the four of us. Hey, you got a lock again. 
I didn't take it. Vaguely, no, yeah, no, it says it was they just stashed it. That's what this is. Oh, um, Shelves are full of cans. Yeah, you're good. You're yeah, good. Okay. This is all the same. Like you, yeah, you can kind of gloss over the idea of these because it's the same as yesterday's. Oh, poor Ted. Ted's dead. Uh, all right. We got you, maniacs. Yeah. Oh, it's the same it's thing. The same thing. All right, Christine. Day one or two. <laughs> okay. Exciting stuff. I wish I had more water. Yeah, I wish you did too. <laughs> Day uh. two. Memories or not, we need to keep our heads clear and get a grip on reality ahead of us. Mary Jane is feeling safe. Who wouldn't in this coffin-sized shelter? Timmy's on his be best behavior. How long will it last? Today's been fine for Dolores thus far. Things seem like they're going well. All right. Well, I mean, food and water-wise, you're you're okay. You're not great. Yeah. Day two. It's tough surviving in these conditions. Let's hope this will be over soon, or else we might end up dead in some di wasteland ditch. That's not something we're looking forward to. So, uh, you're sending you somebody out, out how you, huh? How are you going to do this with a, without a husband? I think I'll manage. All right. Chad, uh, you got a very old school mindset. <laughs> no, I've got a mindset of you're stuck in a bunker and having to send people out. You're going to need expendable bodies. <laughs> okay. And a man. <laughs> I'm going to go outside. Oh, oh wait. Are you going to give them anything to take? Yeah, so that first hand. Ooh. It's not a bad idea. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, you're banking on Dolores again. Yeah. <laughs> Have fun, kids. I'm the mo I'm the parent. I'm not going to send my kids out. I mean, they were willing. That's why you have them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, day four, it's always better when things are calm. Luckily, nothing new happened to Mary Jane today. Timmy seems okay, as much as he can be in our current situation. Dolores is on her way to the surface. Let's hope she'll make it back safe and sound. And I have a gun. Okay. Ted's writing this journal from beyond the grave. Yeah. <laughs> He's watching you. Day four, it's hard to keep track of the time down here. We can't tell if it's night or day. Our sleeping patterns are messed up. God, we not the sleeping again. <laughs> These terrible light bulbs are not help. Can I, could I have like taken a pillow or something? I don't know what don't that know. is. Is that a pillow? I can't tell what that is. That seems like something new. I don't remember that. I don't it know. looks, yeah, it looks like something like or that. Or like a, like a sleeping bag or like a rollout. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, well. Ah, you'll be fine, kids. You're young. <laughs> day five. Oh. Timmy's not Timmy looking great. Timmy doesn't look too good. Uh, he's, he's, I mean, he's, he just looks like he needs yeah. food or water. Nah, you know what? He just looks tired. If anything. Yeah, he is tired. Day yeah. five. <laughs> Bravely ignoring our symptoms. Oh, that's the same thing. Uh, Timmy's really tired. Okay. You know, I'll give him some soup. Yeah, have some soup. Day five. There mm. it goes again. Noises. Weird noises all the time. Are they coming from the pipes? <laughs> walls? Is it something behind the door? Oh, no. We don't know, and it's driving us insane. Oh, we should no. go sit we should sit down and relax, otherwise we might get paranoid. <laughs> Your kids are gonna lose their fucking yeah, minds. They're like, twitchy. Oh, oh shit. she went crazy. Whoa. What? She's going crazy. Why? They the sound. Oh no. What? Mary Jane started acting even more crazy than she usually does. <laughs> She seems to be making a nest. Was it the soup? Is she a bird? Boredom can really get you in the shelter. It can lead you to dark Mary places. Jane went nuts. Trust us. <laughs> oh, God. Should give her something to drink. Give them both something to drink. Yeah. Oh, I don't Jesus. know that Timmy, I could ever. Timmy rested at least. I don't know that I could ever be in a. Christine, the soup may have driven in a her bunker mad. with right. you, Christine. I feel like. Oh, how, about six. how about that trip to Nevada we've been postponing for a while now? Maybe we should go there. That's our first stop after we get out of here. Oh god. Poor Mary Jane. <laughs> she looks crazy. Yeah. Oh no. god. She's still That's that happened to her at the end of the last one. Really? I noticed she was doing that same stance. Yeah. So Ted died. And, and in the she explosion, was all banged but... up too. She had like a splint on. Yeah. <laughs> Day seven. Let's uh. just leave all those questions for <laughs> what? Let's just leave all those questions be for now. Mary Jane seems fine today. Hopefully it will stay that way. It looks she's she's still clucking. <laughs> Timmy seems okay, as much as he can be in their current situation. I mean fine for a loon. Yeah. She's flipped her lid. Uh, we're gonna go. <laughs> oh. Oh, a suitcase again, Christine. Is it always booby trap? No. no. Really? But it still yeah. could be. It's it's random. So do you want to chance it? Yeah. All right. Please don't be a bomb. Please don't be a bomb. <laughs> oh. Yes! Hey. Yes! Oh, shit! You got a flashlight? She brought the gun back? That's good. Nice. Got some more water? Awesome. 
That's a good choice. Looks, she's she's looks pretty tired beach. Damn it to get to- Oh wait! Booby trapped! There was nothing oh. else inside it, it exploded. That explains why she's got bandages on her. Oh. Who? Um... Mary Jane? Mary Jane. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Dolores came back safely, our expedition reached a church which was still standing. Most of it was intact, some people decided to turn it into a shelter as we found out it was more than that. Uh, we weren't sure what religion they followed, but they were very eager to convince us that tomatoes are the source of all evil and eggplants are the only help for salvation. <laughs> Cultists decided they won't be needing any holy water. We did a bit of miracle work and turned empty wine bottles into quite full water bottles. Oh shit. One of the beds in the surviving church quarters was filled with quite a few treasures. Namely a flashlight and a collection of books about evolution. Oh nice. We took the flashlight. Oh. Mary Jane was injured. Timmy's good. Well, at least he was five minutes ago. Dolores would really love to eat. All right. Good. So you know what? I feel like I you're off. Tired. You're you're off to a better start aside from Mary Jane. Clucking. <sighs> Clucking and being damaged by an explosion. <laughs> the other two seem fine-ish, except for Mary Jane, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, you keep feeding her that crazy soup. Well, I just... <laughs> you want to send up for fun. another expedition? Oh, okay. You don't have to. You're not so forced Dolores, to. Dolores is too tired, because she just went on one. <clears throat> hmm. Mary Jane is feeling excellent. Okay. You're going to send crazy out there? <laughs> yeah. Crazy Mary Jane. Maybe crazy's good. See what happens. All right, maybe. Crazy could be just what the yeah, I mean, is needed out there. Know. Give her a fucking axe I'm and nobody will mess axe, with her. Yeah. It's true. They're only Clucking so many... at them, swinging an axe. <laughs> Baka. Uh, play some games. Uh, Do that again. What was that? Baka. 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 It's not good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trying to be good. <laughs> is that, what's your best you know chicken? Uh... Yeah. Sounded like a monkey a little bit. Had a it little did. monkey. Toward the end, it got a yeah. little monkeyish. <laughs> a monkey like chicken. A chicken. <laughs> a chicken. A monkey. Uh. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Day eight. There are only oak, so oak, many oak, things oak. you could do oh, in a God. tiny bunker. So we thought, hey, why not play some games? They're not just for kids, you know? Uh, okay. <laughs> Fucking Mary Jane. Yeah, I know. I can't believe you're going to send her out. I mean, I mean, they you, see that coming at them. They're going to fucking cower in fear. <laughs> Played I Spy. Same thing as last time. Mary Jane needs to drink. Timmy needs to drink. Dolores has to eat. Okay. Kids need to drink. Dolores got to eat. You know what? If you're sending Mary Jane, I would give I would feed her now. Oh, yeah, that's true. All right. You get both. All right. Now you've got an axe. Oh, you've got an axe, a gun or a flashlight. I don't think that would help her at all. No. Padlock. You never know. All right. Send her out with the axe. I don't think I'd go fuck with her. I would not fuck with her. Axe. All right. All right. Day 10. Mary Jane went outside. Let's hope she hurries back soon. Uh, like the good Scotty hey. is, Timmy's making the best out of the situation. He even seems cheerful. Timmy's doing great. He Dolores looks, he has looks not fine. Eaten in a while. I mean, it was a little. I just fed her last the day before. Well, she was gone a while. You know, she's still very hungry. She Fine. might, yeah, she might be just suffering from having been out in that radiation. Yeah. Day 10. We're locked up and it's easy to grow tired of the situation. Dolores has been looking rather down for a while now. She even refuses to eat soup. How crazy is that? It's hard to say if oh. we can help her, but trying to cheer her up might be worth a shot. Oh, well, I don't have anything. Trying to cheer her up and bugs, bug spray was one of the options? Yeah. She uh -oh. gonna fucking huff it? Like... Day 11. Times are hard and there's little we can do to keep everyone's morale up. Let's save our energy for later. Timmy seems okay, as much as he can be. Dolores oh. can't remain thirsty for long. Alright. Yeah, I'll give him some. Day 11. Alarm! Ooh. There's a group of people outside and they don't seem too friendly. We recognize some of them. They used to be in our neighborhood watch. They don't sound too concerned with the well-being of the neighborhood anymore. But they are very serious about angrily waving their heavy <laughs> flashlights. We need to do something before they break in and take everything we have. You got a lock, too. I'm just saying. You could lock it up, or you could just go aggressive and be like, yeah. get the fuck out of here! Christine's yep. going aggressive. We're going aggressive. Fuck these people. Ooh. Unbreakable, I got. Oh, shit! Oh, shit, the gun broke. Oh. Yeah, but you're alive. It's not surprising that a few shots were enough to send those cowards running. The question is, what happens if the rifle malfunctions, or if we use all our ammo? We do shit. hope it won't come to that. Otherwise, we might need to defend ourselves using knives and forks. Uh-oh. Timmy should eat so something. The gun okay. Exploded. Yeah. Whoops. Oh well. 
Oh, hey, flashlight is an option here. It's never a good time to go out into the radioactive wasteland, but it seems that this will become a necessity in this new world of ours. We read this. Okay. Uh, except this time we got the flashlight. Okay. Did I hear it bark? Yeah. Decided to check what was that coming for us with our flashlight. It was a dog! Poor thing seemed tired, so we let it stay Aww. with us for the night. Next morning, we opened the door and let it out. It still hasn't returned. Hopefully, Aww. it will come back later. Maybe it'll come back with something. Maybe? Nothing going on with Timmy. Dolores seems Maybe okay. Eat him. Eat the dog. Oh, no. you saying you wouldn't eat a dog if you had to? No, I'd kill myself first. Well, what if it wasn't your dog? No. no I'd... What You'd if kill yourself what if it was over eating I a go, dog? Unless I go completely mad and don't have my rational self. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah. That's what you would be doing. I like die, dire consequences. Like that's that's death. <laughs> Christine, if it came if down to eat. us dying or the dog, we gotta eat the dog. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's I don't want to. And I'm not sure I could do it with one that was. It would be difficult if it was our own. But I'm gonna be honest. If I if a what dog if it was a really up, cute dog that looked up at you like. Yeah, no, I could. I couldn't. <laughs> I would make sure it died as peacefully as possible before I ate it. That's what I would do at Aww. that point. Yeah. At this, at like, and again, they're not starving. I'm saying that they no, ran out of good. all yeah. your food and you were dying. I don't know. Actually, honestly, dog's metabolism was much faster. It'd probably die first. You just eat it. <laughs> That's true. I ain't they need to my eat. soup. They need to eat fast. Jeez. Day 13. It's been a while. We don't know much about what's happening on the surface. If only we had a chance to tune into some mm. emergency radio broadcast and learn a thing or two. Oh, no radio. Shit. Although dog gets that hungry. Yeah, he's probably going to eat you. Yeah, that's true. It's going to turn into a fight. The winner is going to eat the loser. <laughs> yeah. Day 14. Just they see say me ignorance sitting is on the bliss. one corner Another of dogs day sitting the other words eyeballing each other like growling at each other. <laughs> That'd be All a good right. short film. That would be funny. No, Timmy Water. Day 14. Ooh, flashlight <laughs> again. Oh, Peculiar. yeah. Peculiar. Peculiar. You want to read it? Peculiar. It seems that the whole shelter has been shaking every couple of minutes, and it feels like it's getting stronger every time this happens. Here it comes again, and it's way worse. It's an earthquake. Hold on to something. Well, you, you can use it. the flashlight. I did. That's all you had to hold on to. No, but the, I didn't think you clicked it. I did. Yeah, she did. Oh, you did. I saw a highlight. Oh, God, she's <laughs> back. She's back. And oh, she's in bad Jesus. shape. But oh, a gas mask. She brought a gas mask. And water. Oh, and water. Good job, Mary Jane. No axe, she's, still, she's still clucking, though. She lost the axe. Oh, fuck. She is fucking gone. <laughs> Day 15. That was a close call. The torch was about to hit the floor when we caught it. But honestly, the whole place is a mess. Something might have been broken. We don't know until we look through everything. Let's hope no more quakes will hit us. Nothing made us happier than the sight of Mary Jane returning to the shelter from the surface. It might sound paranoid, but we think someone followed us. Uh-oh. Let's just hope this doesn't happen again. You don't have an axe or a gun anymore. But I have a padlock. Oh, well, yeah. That's true. We went on a trip to a more specific place this time, a local museum on Tranquility Lane. Several rooms and a corridor, while decorated with some charred paintings that survived the blast. The old place doesn't even look that bad. It's almost like a modern art exhibit. In front of the museum canteen, we found a box with some water bottles in it. Wait, it, so I don't think sh I don't think Mary Jane brought back anything. I don't know. Did she bring back the gas mask, or was that... I think so. I, okay. I think she did. Yeah. In front of the museum canteen, we found a box with some water bottles in it. It was probably left there by some delivery company. That delivery company is probably out of business now. I guess it was that it was blown out of the market. Uh, we were hoping for some sweets or snacks, but all the museum ha canteen had was uh, to offer us tomato soup. Those poor, poor tourists. <laughs> so you got two, two waters, two soups, and a gas mask. Yeah. Day 15. Between the rubble, we found a half-destroyed statue of a lady. She didn't have a lot of clothes on, save for a gas mask someone put on her face, probably as a joke. We were hesitant to approach as the lady was dressed immodestly. <laughs> Who cares? But then we saw she was holding an urn. As long as there's an urn, it's art, and it's okay to look at it. <laughs> Everyone knows that. That's true. We returned from the expedition, but our axe didn't make it. Aww. Mary Jane is quite hungry and tired. No news is good news. There's nothing new going on with Timmy. All right. Life is hard for us it's all right day. now, but Dolores it's is a good in day. good mood. All right. A lot better than the, your last fifteenth day. Yeah, you were all dead. Yep. Oh, only Timmy could go now, because Dolores is too feeble. Yeah. All right. You gonna send Timmy, huh? Yeah. Ooh, stump on the remains of a bandit shanty town. Someone or something tore it down. Incidentally, amidst the rubble, we found a cat licking its paws nonchalantly, surrounded by blood and dismembered limbs. As we made our way back to the shelter, the cat followed. We can now hear its paws impatiently scratching our hatch. 
Should we let it inside? Yeah. You know, let in the fucking feral cat who was yeah. living in an abandoned bandit shantytown? Yeah. Yeah, there he is. He's cool. Look at him. <laughs> the cat's, the cat's <laughs> face. Where he's just like, yep. Yep. <laughs> Looks like if it had a voice, it would be fucking. Was her arm like, bandaged f- yeah. before? No, she is just. She's she's in bad shape. How did she break her arm now? No. When we opened the hatch, the cat jumped in and marched around the whole shelter, sniffing all of us. <laughs> Every wall, corner, empty soup can, and piece of furniture. Finally, it picked a quiet place, sat down, and let out a deep sigh before taking a 12 hour nap. Aww. Its collar has Sherry. Sherikov? Sherikov. Sherikov. It's Russian. Etched into it. What kind of name is that? Mary Jane's diet could use a little food. Mary Jane is no longer crazy. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh! Timmy is good. Well, at least he was five minutes ago. Dolores hasn't eaten or... Okay. Dolores gotta eat and drink. I'm gonna give Timmy some water. Fuck it, Mary Jane's miserable. Actually. Timmy. Good call. Is there anything you could take? Mm. Maybe that gas mask. I don't know. It'd be good. Goodbye, Timmy. <laughs> Bye, Timmy. Hope good you luck. come back. Good luck. You're doing good. You're on day 17. You got a cat. I think you're doing just fine. All right. Oh, you got bug spray. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Day 17. While playing in the shelter, Shadikov stumbled upon a small wooden box that was hidden behind some loose bricks. Oh, it contained some useless memorabilia and an old can of bug spray. Mary Jane's diet could use a little food. Timmy, wait on to the wasteland. We don't know what he'll do if he doesn't come back. It's a funny phrase. You know, my diet could use a little food. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mary Jane, or Dolores is fine as well, as much as anyone can be. Okay. Okay. Good. Day 17. Confined spaces are not a very friendly environment, and we quickly got into an argument over some trivial things. If this keeps on, we might find ourselves in a nasty place. Day 18. Doing good. All right. Uh, so theoretically... Or hypothetically, rather. Mm-hmm. If we were in a bunker, it was you, Russ, me, and Tuck. Ah. Who would go out on the expedition? Who would... You... This, you're, you're Dolores. You're calling the shots. Who do you Who? send out? I feel like I would go. I knew she'd say that. She's a woman of action. Yeah. <laughs> and you know what? I'd probably let her. <laughs> you would, you asshole. <laughs> what if I say I'm going to? I'd be like, this no. is the worst decision Why? you ever made. I feel like, uh, not that I, not. Christine, you're emasculating me in front of Chad and Tuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I feel like it would be, I feel like I, it would go better if I was alone. But I could do good too. <laughs> I could do good too. We could, we could split Plus up. 2018. We could split up. Uh, I, I would go one way, you go another. No, I'd say that's we bad. Meet. That's why me- is that bad? Because ev- do you not know every time a movie or a television show does that thing where like let's split up, it's always something bad I'd happens. I'd have to go to. What's the difference? It would just be you going alone I'd and have me to go going to alone. Then, yeah. Because if I were left alone in a bunker <laughs> with Tuck. I think you would eat him. We just said You'd talk. come back to one of us being yeah, alive. Yeah, you'd eat him. You'd just he be would like, either kill me because I drove him nuts, or I'd kill myself. It would be his Could body we? roasting on a spit. Yeah. Christine, there was we a just poop? send Tuck? No, because then we'll, we'll, That's what I was hoping. No, he'll, he, he, um, I love Tuck, but I don't. You don't trust you don't, him? You don't I trust myself over him to find stuff. You don't trust oh. Tuck to go out and find supplies? No, because he'll be like, eh. And just stand there. He, he also he doesn't seem very handy in an apocalypse. No, he doesn't seem like he doesn't have a go getter attitude. I feel like <laughs> you would, I, you saw did you did you? I'm watch? too much of a wild card. There's a chance that I can go out there and just want to die. <laughs> <laughs> did you ever see the road? No. Oh, okay. Well, in it, it's not spoilers because it's the beginning of the movie. Um, <laughs> the it's not wife, the, no, no, that's the middle of the movie. I know what you're saying. The Charlie's Throne scene? Yeah, that's not the middle. Yeah, that gets revealed throughout the movie. Oh, all Spoilers right. for the road. See, spoilers for the road. She she can't take it anymore, and she just walks out into the woods and never comes back. In the middle of the snow, she yeah. just gets this blank look, she stands just, up, she just stands walks up. out the front door, and he's like, please, please, honey, what are you doing? Please step out of it. She yeah. just, like, walks. And then it's dark, there's snow. Well, yeah. it's ash, but it's just falling, and she just disappears into the gray. That's yeah. me. You never yeah. see her again. Yeah. That's me, where I just I look at like, you all and I just. 
But I feel Nod like my head and walk outside. <laughs> I feel like that would be more tuck than you. No. Then we find out you start calling people for a ride on your way home. Yeah. On your, as you walk. <laughs> That's old school. No, I, I feel like I feel like I'd be like the Danny McBride in This Is the End, where I've got a fucking like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. All of a sudden, I'm eating people, and I'm yeah. just like, "This is fucking great." You guys missed not being in that bunker. <laughs> <laughs> See, the end of the world. I would just want to do a bunch of drugs. Oh well, I mean, I would eat so many people. <laughs> I you know. Have well, no idea. I saw the look you gave that fucking leg muscle at the body's exhibit. Fuck yeah, I eat that shit. You were yes. like, I mean, looking at it like a fucking ribeye steak in front of you. It was. <laughs> it was. That was what it was. It was a hunk of meat. We'll have to remember right, that if anything ever happens. <laughs> All right, Christine. Come All right, on, sorry. day eighteen. These aren't edited. These are one episode things. Day 18. We stopped arguing, but for how long? Mary Jane isn't worried, or at least she's not saying it, saying so out loud. Dolores is quite calm, given the situation. Well, they seem fine. I want to call Tuck and pose this hypothetical to him. Let's see what his what, what he thinks. <laughs> you know, we got to get Tuck to play this game on here. It's true. <laughs> okay. This is a perfect game. This has to be a, like, yeah, this is what we just get people This is play. a very accessible game because anybody can do it. Yeah. yeah. Day 18. We were about Jeez. to finish our dinner, if you can call it that, when we heard someone knocking at the door. It seems to be a traitor who is very interested <gasps> in ammunition. Oh, How about that? We don't have ammunition. Nope. Very hope he doesn't get angry about that. <laughs> Day 19. All right. We could tell the stranger was disappointed, but that was none of our business. If ever, if, if ever was a time to get used to life being disappointing, <laughs> the end of the world is probably it. Ooh, the injury Mary Jane has uh, may take a while to heal. Dolores will not last long without water. Okay. Give her soup and I'll give her water. You're on day 19. I, you might pass Russ. You, you, I, I mean, I was almost out of supplies at this you point. You were fucking, So, yeah. Yeah. I don't know how I lasted 20-something days. I hope She's doing be- all this without Ted. That's pretty good. See? See, that's the thing. She had let, you Fucking know doubted me, don't, didn't you? You know what? He was just a fucking I liability. Is, I think this is the perfect number of family mem- family members. You want me to be honest? Yeah. I still doubt you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Day 19. We woke up to a dripping sound today and noticed there's something leaking from the pipes. Uh, Uh-oh. Oh, that no. green liquid looked innocent enough, even oh, no. after it ate through the table and the chair and the floor. Patching up that pipe is probably a good idea. Oh, if only you had that oh, gas mask. Oh. Uh, well, shit. What's the what's the green liquid? I don't know. How long's Timmy been gone? Uh, two or three days. Oh yeah, he's been gone a few for days. a few days. So maybe three days now. Day twenty. We couldn't figure it out, so we just assumed that's what a regular pipe would do in the event of a nuclear apocalypse, and decided to ignore oh, it. No. We've been feeling a bit funny today, though. Uh oh. Probably no connection to the pipe. None oh, whatsoever. No. Mary Jane is quite thirsty. Dolores is quite calm. Okay. Jesus. Day 20. We can keep sitting on our backsides here in this tiny little bunker, or we can start thinking about getting uh, away as far as possible from this radioactive wasteland. Who would have thought the Reds would ruin such a lovely neighborhood? We could do it. Uh, we could do it on our own, the escaping part, not the ruining part, of course. However, there might not be someone. There might be someone out there who can help us. Let's keep our eyes and ears open. No radio. Uh, shit. Okay. <sighs> <sighs> well, you're definitely going to pass me at this point because supplies, you're just doing great on. So you hit 21 days, right? I can't remember this. 20 something for sure. Day 21. Or 20, actually, I think you hit 23. For some reason, that's sticking in my head. Uh, day 21. If there are, is, well, if there is one thing we need to do, it's to use a, reg- a radio on a regular basis to catch any emergency broadcast that might be transmitted in our area. It's either that or it's strolling around outside waiting to get picked up. The first option sits a bit, <laughs> sounds a bit more sane. Mary Jane might not admit it, but we're pretty sure she wants to get her injuries patched up. Life is hard for all of us right now, but Dolores is in a good mood today. All right. We hope it'll stay Things this way. All right. Day 21. While trying to get the li- <laughs> while trying to pet the little devil, we found a piece of paper on its collar with an address scribbled on it. Could its previous owners still be around and worried sick? Chances are slim, but maybe we should pay them a visit. Oh. Or at least what's ever left of them. What do you think? I mean... Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. The end. Oh, okay. <laughs> Day 22. Aww. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's gone. Well, you probably brought it back. Day 22. Before we reached the end of our street, we were stopped by two men wearing dark coats and stylish hats. They, oh, no. They rushed towards the cat to pick him up, saying they've, oh, they've been looking for him for a while now. Supposedly, Sherikov belongs to an old lady who's rather Uh-oh. fond of it and misses the little guy dearly. Aw, we shrugged and went back to our shelter. 
Cat didn't seem to care, so why should we? Good thing we didn't get too attached to it the last few days. Mary Jane contracted an illness. Dolores would really love something to eat. Okay. Oh, shit. That's not good. Mary Jane has had a rough go of it yeah. this point. She really has. Day 22. Surviving down here is no walk in the park. It won't get any easier. We're hopeful this will blow over soon and life will be back to what it used to be. Timmy really needs to get his ass back here. <laughs> yeah. Do, is, uh, is it possible that they just no, don't come back? Yeah. Yeah, that happened to happened to me. That happened to her. Oh, yeah. It happened it? to you, too. Yeah. Remember? The first playthrough. Oh, shit. I Dolores remember. didn't come back. Timmy's back. Oh, yeah. Dolores never came back. Holy oh, shit. Timmy's. Look at him. Did yes. he bring a bunch of soup? He brought a suitcase. And the, and and the, the gas, gas mask. mask back. Uh, being stuck in such a tiny shelter would make anyone a bit apathetic. We need to stay calm and await the rescue. Surely they're coming for us, right? <laughs> yeah, right. We were so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wasteland and is safe with us now. We believe that our expedition to the wasteland must have, be, uh, must have been followed by strangers. We should be more cautious next time. A pile of car wrecks revealed that we stumbled across a big parking lot. Almost no cars survived the blast wave, but we went to, between the wrecks to explore anyway. Under the burnt remains of a picnic table, we found some bottled water. Those bottles were not in the best state, but their contents looked perfectly drinkable. It seems like the bomb interpreted oh. er, interrupted someone's picnic. Thankfully, they were, big, they were big fans of tomato soup. It's all soup. You got you and got they, two soups and two waters. Yeah. You've done pretty well sending people That's out. That's pretty good. Uh, one of the trunks, we found a leather suitcase. It's almost untouched. We're a bit disappointed there was nothing inside, but the suitcase alone will do just fine. Well, what's the point of that? Sweet. Mary Jane is still rather sick. Timmy should eat something. Earlier, that was an option for when there was that drip. It said something with the suitcase. Yeah. Don't know what it was, but... You just click their faces to... Oh, they're full. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Everyone eats on day 23. We're not certain about... <laughs> Nobody's going out. All right. Sure. We're celebrating the fact that we just passed Russ. <laughs> day 23. It's not the best time or place to make <laughs> plans for the future. Oh, she's... But we she can't go help past you and or get to the end. If, uh, but we can't help thinking about what... Uh, what how many days honest. do you have? I don't think so. What, I think she many, might make it to the end. I don't think she'll ever beat me. How many days do you... Me? Oh, no, we how should... many days till the end? Like... No, I don't say because I don't even know. Well, the, no, it's it. there's no set amount of days. I th it, Like, it could happen. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. It's all dependent on what materials you have, what happens to you. It's, it's like, random. Okay. Uh, day two... Uh, is our house still standing, or will we have to move to some forsaken hole like Toronto? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, jeez. Take wow. that, Toronto. Jeez. Yeah. Isn't that where uh, Geo lives right now? They're near it. <gasps> Day 24. What was that noise? The cat's back! Oh! oh wow, okay. Uh, and, and Mary Jane's not yeah. looking well. Day 24, let's just leave all the squish. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, to our surprise, we found Shredica back in our shelter this morning. We're not exactly sure why or how it came back. Uh, is there a good carrot appreciates, our kind hearts, optimism? Or just our stockpile of soup cans? Only time will tell. Mary Jane is pretty fatigued. Yeah, okay. Timmy should eat something. Dolores has rested. Oh, uh, Dolores can now go out ooh. again. But do I have... I don't have a weapon or anything. No, but you don't necessarily need to send them out with a weapon. You didn't send Timmy out with a weapon. That's true. You just had a gas mask. Day 24. A young singer approached our shelter this morning. Encumbered by two different guitars, a big backpack, and a weird contraption holding up a harmonica in front of his face, he asked for some supplies in exchange for a folk song or two. Ooh. Oh! Do we want to share? You want to share some soup? What do you have a lot of? of? I think you're better off with soup. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, give him a soup. A soup for a song. Day 25. <laughs> <His> song <gasps> <gasps> radio! He gave you a radio! Yes! His songs brought tears to our eyes. With good, talented Americans like that, hopefully the times are changing for the better soon. The sound of his guitar kept blowing in the wind towards us as he walked away. Our love for his music moved him so much, he even gifted us, <laughs> gifted us a working radio. Are there are there any drugs we could give Mary Jane? Uh, nope. Timmy's very hungry. All right. How about the drug of song? Yeah. And soup. <laughs> <laughs> the drug of song and soup. Songs yeah. and soups. Folk Day song. 25. We need to make a choice for today's expedition. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. So notice that the suitcase opens up the other hands. Yeah. So if you wanted to, you could send her with like the suitcase and oh. a flashlight. Or you could send her with like the. So. Duh, the radio. Hold on to that. All right. All right. Goodbye, Dolores. Hope you make it. Uh, 
Oh, she ain't looking good. Yeah, she looks the same. J26, Mary Jane didn't cause any trouble today, and no trouble dared to cross her path. <laughs> Timmy's been talking about nothing other than water. He should drink some. Dolores is on her way to the surface. Let's hope she'll make it back safe and sound. I don't know. She's, for, she's pretty geared up. Yeah. Well. Get that water back. Yeah. <laughs> Day 26. A loud crash, a, se a surprise shriek, oh, no. and a bit of debris falling from our ceiling. Truly a recipe for a good start to the day. As it turns out, Shadikov found a new toy, a bit of innocuous wiring that ripped out of the wall. <gasps> Who knows what the cable's for? But our lights are still on, so it can't be that important, right? Should we take the wire away from our fluffy friend and investigate it? Um, I don't know. Yeah. Keep it uh, interesting. All right. I'm going for it. Day 27. They're alive. We grabbed the cable and, it follow and followed it to a rusty old truck parked in our neighborhood's driveway. Upon opening the door, we were confronted with two men wearing huge headphones who looked extremely surprised to see us. They wiretapped our shelter when we were asleep and they were listening to everything we said. We gave them hell and marched back to our bunker. We gave them hell? Yeah. <laughs> oh, Mary Jane can take a lot, but her wounds are looking terrible. We need to do something. To me, it's on his best behavior. How long will it last? This is these two guys that took uh, Sherikov before. Right. I don't know. Maybe. That, it could I be. Don't I don't remember any of this from the old playthrough. Day well, 27. it's random, so you might not oh, hear it. Uh, the agents who are spying on us are now at the door and want to explain themselves. Should we hear them out? I'm curious, personally. I am, too. I, I kind of want to know what they it. have the to end. say. The end. Day 28. <sighs> They were agents, real live secret agents on a government mission. We saw their identity cards briefly. They, were, they weren't they were listening in on us. It was the cat they were interested in. They made a request too, wanting us to aid them with some of their top secret missions in the future. If we do that, they promise they will extract us to a government safe house full of supplies and donuts. Oh! Hopefully they will come back with more information. Mary Jane could take a lot. Okay, she's still. Oh no, I want a donut. <laughs> Should have grabbed him from Wawa. Uh, I have a cinnamon bun if you want. No. It's not the same. Not the oh, same. well, all right. Oh, jeez. Uh, who's looking? Uh, She's just wounded. Give her water, at least. Day 28. There has been some radio uh, chatter about air Oh, no, from the no military. gas mask. It's oh, about time. Oh, no. Yeah. All those taxes <laughs> had to pay for a crate or two for us, right? Shall we head out to get them? Oh. Uh, Come on, Dolores. Day 29. Oh my god. It was too dangerous to go out there without any protection, so we decided to stay indoors and listen to the radio. The static is so relaxing. <laughs> Alright. Mary Jane ain't looking good. Nope. I don't think... Day 29. Uh. We always thought life could be much better. That was before we got nuked. Now we think of... <laughs> now we think life could be much better. Uh, in a way, not that much has changed. Okay. It's depressing. I know. Day 30. You oh. made it 30 days. Made it 30 goddamn days. That cat Ooh. looks so comfortable up yeah. there. Yeah. Day 30. Fond memories are one thing, but we need to be ready for the harsh reality that awaits us. All right. Mary Jane's not looking good. How long's Dolores been out? Christine, you're getting low on water. I'm yeah, sorry. I know. A few days. Nothing too long, though. Day 30. We stumbled upon a weird signal when changing radio frequencies. We we're pretty sure that behind layers of terrible static and screams, we could hear a voice. A voice speaking in a foreign language. Oh, dear. What if it's the Soviets? The Soviets? Oh, well, we, should probably, last we should probably listen to it. But what about the children? It's the only children down here. Yeah. yeah. So, uh... He, like, activates us. <laughs> they were, like, Russian <laughs> the sleeper Oh, agents. no! No! It did! Whoa. Mary Jane's inquiries were enough to make her angry at us. Oh my god. Or at least the fact that we decided not to do anything about well, what them. Are we gonna when we got up, we found a note from her claiming she deserves better and that she had left for Canada because <laughs> that is a better public health care system. Oh no. We were wow. we were relieved at first when we figured out it wasn't Soviets we heard. It turned out it was Canadians, which isn't that much better. Oh jeez. Either way, they're foreigners and we couldn't understand what they were saying. What, not a word. French? How disappointing. Maybe. Timmy should eat something. Alright. <laughs> oh. Day 31. The cat is growling in the general direction of us and our supplies. We're not sure if the if cat's drink soup, but it's the only thing on the menu today, and it's up to us if we want to share our tomato. Yeah. All right. You're very low on soup. Well, it's only Timmy, so. 
Oh, what? what Jesus. Happened? What? The little devil utterly devoured the whole can in less than 60 seconds, left nothing behind. Not even a drop. After that, it took a long, peaceful nap. At least it won't bother us for a while now. Of all places, we could have perished. This is probably the best one, or maybe not. We held out for 32 days. What Wait, happened? What happened? So, do you think Dolores died? Dolores, Dolores didn't come back. So one of the adults has to live? Uh, oh, yeah. Dolores was captured. She was captured? Oh! Oh, Dolores! Oh, man. Yeah, I believe the parents both have to live. That sucks. I kind of wish that... Uh, that it could just be Timmy. That we had left Timmy behind and crept Ted. Because then this wouldn't be a problem right now. <laughs> uh, somebody didn't want to listen. Well, that was fun. You know, maybe if you had brought I, uh, Ted along Somebody after all. Uh, thinks she can do everything herself. Doesn't yep. need a man. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That lasted 32 days. 32 days. Very impressive. That's not bad. Especially Very. just for your second time playing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, seriously. Three right. out of four successful expeditions. It's funny because you could keep redoing it and it'll be different. And yeah. it's always different. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for... I was kind of yeah. wishing that aliens would show up. I have no idea. I'm sure it That's can happen. New. I have yeah. no idea how it comes into play. <laughs> we'll see. But uh, Well, I noticed it said 15 days until 60 parsecs. So maybe there's more oh, stuff coming out. That's it. I forgot okay. about that. The, yeah. So it's, it's coming soon. We'll have to play that sometime after okay. it comes out. Fuck yeah. yeah. But thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Comment below. Uh, comment on Christine's performance. Let us know in the comments <laughs> if you've ever played this and how how you did. If anything interesting happened to you, let yeah. us know. How many days did you last? Yeah. And we'll, uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow with something else. Yeah. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.